Everyone, so in this video I'm going to uh, review and talk about this brand new Screen Factory's 1974 Black Christmas on 4K Ultra HD. And I'm very excited for this actually that I that I actually got it uh, before Christmas and they did a great job with uh, the release date right before Christmas uh, even not like let's say a week or a day or a few days but actually they give us like three four weeks before Christmas so we can have the time to get it watch it and all of that uh, so it was a great release and uh, I actually pre-ordered it from uh, Amazon like uh, about a month ago uh, because I didn't got it from Screen Factory directly because I felt like I don't want the poster and all of that So I just got it from Amazon, which I usually do either Screen Factory or I do it from Best Buy But this time I picked Amazon and uh, Until like a few days ago I noticed they haven't still shipped it yet So I wanted this movie as early as possible so I cancelled it and I waited until to see if there's a Best Buy store pickup and I got it today actually from Best Buy and it was a better idea than getting it from Amazon for this specific film. Um, and I was actually looking at the artwork this morning and uh, I was trying to see if I like this artwork more or the old uh, Screen Factory, the Blu-ray version. Um, and I will go with the Blu-ray version as far as the artwork, I mean the, the cover and stuff. But this one is pretty good too and here's the back even though I'm gonna uh, go over it when I open the back around the cover. Uh, it's a pretty good release, it's a terrifying genre and masterpiece and it comes with a lot of uh, special features uh, and I can't wait to actually check it on 4K and I, don't, I actually don't have any copies uh, from Black Christmas. I watched this film actually last year uh, on Peacock and it was a pretty good film and can't wait to compare the, uh, the qualities between uh, let's say a Blu-ray to a 4K. Uh, so yeah, let's open the bag and see uh, the inside all right so let's open this and actually see the inside um, I'm actually curious if it comes with uh, another image like a flip through image which we're gonna find out of course here's the front that I already show uh, it's a pretty good image but let's check the inside Remove the the slip cover. I absolutely love when the movies come with the slip cover. So uh, I I like usually movies when they release, uh, at least from the Screen Factory. Once the you know they start selling more, then they I think they run out of the slip cover. So they are more like a limited amount. So if you guys really want it with the slip cover, I would say any movies when they come out, try to pick it up right away in the first uh, one or two months before before they all start selling out. Um, but yeah, let's actually check to see if one of the films, one of the discs are actually loose, uh, which I'm going to put it back. Uh, oh, damn, they're all. I had to stop the video because all the discs, when I opened it, they all uh, came out. Um, I'm noticing that actually, which is, I don't know if this is uh, from what, but you guys can see it. There's some. Uh, things in there which it doesn't make it look so perfect the inside and also the, the inside too you can see there's a the disc line right there I was like all dirty I don't know if you guys can see it in the camera uh, but yeah I remember there was this issue similar thing with um, the Chucky the, all the Charles play one two three uh, so now let's see if there is a actual Flip through an image or no there is not there's no image which is kind of disappointing but uh which i love when they give a another image but it's just the same thing uh, no image i remember with uh, prince of darkness they did that too and that's one of my favorite movies but it didn't have uh, flip through image which I personally like it when they come with the flip through image. It's more interesting. You can switch it because you don't want the exact same image that uh, the slip cover has. Uh, but yeah, here's the actually the 4K disc. This is the 4K Ultra HD picture film. You can see the disc. So the disc fell down to redo it again, but here's the, the 4K disc that you can see. Uh, I like the image actually, the 4K one. 
And uh, here's the Blu-ray one. Actually, it comes with uh, two discs. One is the Blu-ray and one is, the, of course, the special features. You can see both here. So all work out good. Actually, I'm not sure if uh, probably this uh, Blu-ray one is the same that uh, they did it with the Blu-ray release years ago. Uh, let me know if it's the same image with, uh, of course, a special feature disc. As far as the discs are pretty good. I like the 4K one. Uh, 4K and Blu-ray, yeah, they both are 98 minutes. Uh, so yeah, it's, the movie is not long. Uh, but yeah, it comes with a bunch of uh, special features. Uh, new 2022 4K scan of the original camera negative. Uh, presented in the Dolby version. New 2022 res uh, restoration of the original monotrack. But well, you can see the screen, uh, also the special feature list that I will close you guys can pause and read. These are everything, it's a bunch of lists, uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, I feel like it's going to be a great uh, 4K release. Uh, and as far as like, if I want to recommend getting this on 4K, just to check it out. Uh, if you guys love, overall when I love a movie, um, I usually transfer it on 4K, I get the 4K version, even if I have the Blu-ray. Uh, but of course, I'm not going to get multiple copies. Let's say if I already have a 4K, I personally don't get more. Unless if the artwork is crazy and it's really nice and I get it. But if you guys don't really care for a movie, let's say if you guys don't like the Black Christmas that much. And you guys have the Blu-ray one, I would say probably it's just like just take on the Blu-ray. You don't need the 4K. Unless if you guys love it or just, just overall want to see uh, how the, the movie is going to look. Uh, but I personally will don't have any copies of the Black Christmas. I watched this digitally and also online from Peacock. I remember last year, uh, which was I absolutely, lo I absolutely love this film. Uh, it's my probably second or third favorite Christmas movie, of course with uh, Krampus and Silent Night Deadly Night. But if I want to compare this with the Silent Night Deadly Night, I think I like the Silent Night a little bit more. Uh, let me know what you guys think, if you guys like this movie, what's your favorite scene. It's a pretty creepy, creepy Christmas movie, I would say, uh, which I really like. And I can't wait to check it on 4K, either today or tomorrow. And I'm definitely going to rewatch it again, uh, probably around Christmas, when it gets more Chris close to Christmas. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. If this is a password pick up, you guys picked it up yet. Uh, if you guys really want to get the 4K one, I would re definitely recommend picking it up. Uh, as soon as possible before the sleepover is gone. I personally love when the movies come with the sleepover, um, which that's what I prefer. So I would recommend picking this one up uh, as fast as possible. So uh, and also feel free to like and subscribe for more unboxing and review videos. And until next time, I'll see you guys later.